Okay, in order to use Compo Pack 45 for the nitrogen world generator, you go to, you follow the link I have to the 7 Days to Die form. You scroll down to the Compo Pack 45 download link. You click that. It'll take you to the Dropbox. You download, direct download. You can go ahead and open nitrogen, open the output folder, and go ahead and close nitrogen. Get the uh, world generator, hit the resources, find your Seven days to die file location. Open the data to go ahead and get those ready. You want to make sure you have the prefabs folder open. When it's downloaded, you can show in your folder. Go ahead and close your browser. I like to drag the files to the desktop or the zipped file to the desktop just so I can see better what I'm doing. Extract it to its own file. Open the file. Open that folder. Go into nitrogen. Take both of these. Drag them into the resources folder. Go ahead and replace them. The folder that says, please copy all files from this folder. Go ahead and control A. Cut. You can close that. You can close the resource folder. In the prefabs folder, paste. And you're just copying all the prefabs into the prefab folder. I already have this, so replace. And close it. Open nitrogen. Make the map as you want. Under prefab list, it's going to be the A19 vanilla default because we didn't change the name. I don't recommend changing the name of the prefab list. There you go. That works. That's the uh, that's the actual uh, compo pack forty five right there. Thank you.